Hello, people. Rob, your face down edge again. Back with some more contrast. Now, this is a world I'm looking forward to exploring more, so let's get right into it. Remember, I'm gonna go spy on the mother and whoever that figure was. That's Daddy. Oh, what are you doing here? You're singing good tonight, Ken. Don't smooth talk me, Johnny. We had an agreement. Is that what you call it? I never wanted to leave. You kicked me out. You want money from me, Johnny? Because I'm ducking the land. I don't need a handout, babe. Look at this suit. You work in another one of your famous deals? This one's big, Cat. Oh, sure it is. Till it blows up like last time and the time before Not that. Not this time, babe. I'm going to make it all up to you. I got to get back on stage. Then meet me after. I'm staying at the Excelsior. But you think you're just going to jitterbug your way back into our lives with a lot of sweet talk? It's going to be better this time, babe. You're going to see how much better it can be. Room 529, kiddo. Where is he going? I need to talk to him. The whole everybody else appearing as shadows is both very thematic as well as a clever way to save on animation costs. check yeah Johnny Ferris the cat knight yeah okay bounce check tells the story it also looks like I missed one secret thing and it looks like it's too late to go back for it oh well He just went through the gate. I bet he's going to the bar. Great. Mommy said Daddy left us, but that's not true, is it? She kicked him out. It won't open. But you could break it open. What? You're pretty strong. What? Oh! Come on, it's Jeez. this way. Kid, are you just making up superpowers for me as we go along? Vincenzo! He's a world-famous illusionist. What's Daddy doing with him? Huh. Okay, they just taught me I could break these things open. Where are you going? Daddy went in there. And I'm sure Daddy has a very nice cutscene for us, but I want to do a little exploring. Oh, okay. There's Mommy, and there's maybe Vincenzo, and why are we in Silent Hill? What the crap? Okay. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Oh. That's creepy. Okay. Is this going to start another? Yeah, it is. Excelsior, that's where the father is, or going to be. But, uh, first, to the bar. Come on, Vincenzo, it's just some film footage of your act. Why can't you let me borrow it just overnight? 
Because it is my new act and it's top secret, which is why my agent has it safely locked in his office upstairs. I just want to show it to my investors. They want to get to know you better. Mr. Fenris, I have performed my illusion act for the King of England and the Emperor of Japan. There are untouchables in India who tell stories of the amazing Vincenzo. If your investors don't know me, they're not in show business. You think I can't pay you? Look at this suit. I'm staying at the Excelsior Hotel. I've asked around about you, Mr. Fenris. People tell me not to trust you. And I've asked around about you, Mr. Amazing. You're not as flush as you look. You've got a few debts. Which is why I think you'll perform at the opening night of my circus. You dare accuse me look, of- Look, I made a beautiful poster. Now I just need to borrow your film reel. Until I see some earnest money from you, I'm damned if I will lend you the time of day. All right. I'll get you a check. Cash. Cash, don't worry. I'll call you tomorrow. It's been such a pleasure meeting with you. Thanks for the drink. So this is probably the big deal that he's trying to do. All right. Oh, that is a nice poster. Okay. Yeah, did good work on that. smoke no mirrors the amazing Vincenzo hides his secrets in plain sight okay Vincenzo. If your investors haven't heard about me, they're stupid. This oh no, awesome. there's no way to get across. I know. If we could get the spotlight working, then I could track you with it. But it's out of power. We need some luminaries. Do you have any? I got bunches. Also, why aren't you worried about the end of the world? Why are you look why are you not worried about the endless nothingness beneath us? And the crap that's floating around. Oh shit, alright. Boop. Boop. Alright. Okay, it's automatically tracking me. That's good. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. So the trick of that is I'm going to have to jump into the real world and then back into a shadow real quickly. Okay, neat. Or 
I'm gonna have to jump onto a solid object right there and not be dumb. I'm pretty sure there's a solid object for me to jump onto. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I had it. I had it. One of the really nice things about this is they know this part's a little punishing and a little tough, and the respawn time lets you get right back into it. This is really good game design. It's okay if something's punishing and difficult. As long as they make up for it and stuff like that. There we go. It's too far. Can you help me, please? Responsible adult like creature, I should probably not let her goodness, it was such walk a big across jump. rubble. Across this, the endless nothingness that nobody pays attention to, that nobody else knows about it but you. Only you know about the endless darkness approaching more and more and more. Anyway, back to the game. Doopy 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 doo. Here we go. Oh, all right. They're closed. Souvenirs. No. 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 I see what that is. It's a police box. That er, let me over there. Let me over there. I want to run away with the doctor. Let me over there. No! Alright, well... I I'm not sure if the... That's probably fitting for the time period, but still... That's... I'm calling that the TARDIS. This is officially a Doctor Who episode. And... That certainly makes everything make a little bit more sense somehow. Look at that, that's the ground unravel. That's oh that's nice. Okay. Well Oh, it's locked. Oh wait! Think that's just I it... told you I was good at fixing things. This kid's a lockpick? Okay, she's inventing superpowers for both of us now. Maybe you could find another way in. kid just left me, alright. Find a way into the theater. Uh, okay. This is gonna be neat. right should be able to jump here hey these are just cool little puzzles I like it all right what do we got here record of John a Ferris alias Johnny Mac posting bad checks okay so he's either a con artist or just really bad with money. I'd probably go with con artist, actually. Uh, let's see. So. Okay, I made you a great poster. The dude photoshopped. 
I'm not sure how, but that's that's the same picture of him. He just added some flares around the back. I mean, yeah, that's how he would do it, but still. All right. Wait, what was that? Oh, I'm a shadow. I can move through glass. Well, that's just neat. What is that? It says Jack on there. Alright. Dee Dee. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be out this late. Where's your mom? Did mommy really kick you out? Were you spying on us at the cabaret? Are you coming home? Yes. <laughs> That's my plan. I've got to convince your mother. Is she here? No, I snuck out. <laughs> oh boy, you're growing up fast. You used to be scared of the dark. But did she really kick you out? Well, yeah, kind of. At the time, I wasn't being very good to her, so I guess I had it coming. I missed you so much. I missed you too, honey. But I'm gonna come back home. I'm putting together a circus, see? It's gonna pay for everything. And you know who it's gonna star? The amazing Vincenzo. <laughs> How much snooping around have you been doing? Yeah, it's gonna star the amazing Vincenzo. He's good, huh? Look, you're really not supposed to be out this late. I'm I'm gonna take you home. I brought you the mirror. Shh, shh, shh. But... shh. Uh, I got a couple of investors coming here, and they don't like kids much. I need you to run home by yourself, okay? But I brought you... Didi, you have to get out of here. I won't tell Mom you snuck out. Okay, go. Hey, Carmine, Silvio. He doesn't have the money to show them. His name is Salvio, so why are we here? Salvio, yeah, what did I say? I got great news. Vincenzo is in. You have to show you got him? You're sure? Sure, I'm sure. He's gonna play opening night. Really bring in the crowds. So that's why you brought us here, huh? You're gonna show us his act? Yeah, yeah, except uh, the projector's broken. Because if you don't got him, your circus is gonna flop and you're not gonna be able to pay us back. And then I'm gonna have to break your arms and then we see how well you swim. Look, I'm gonna need just a little more money to uh, finalize things with Vincenzo. Are you kidding me? What'd you spend that money on, that soup? Listen, it's all gonna come back to you. Oh! Show them the movie! Show them the movie! Okay. Gotta get in there, gotta get in there. Oh, oh you broke my finger! Oh! Hey, knock it off, Sal. Check this out. Jeez, he is amazing. I told you I got him. Okay, let's go get your money. Thanks a bunch. Look, why don't I swing by tomorrow and pick it up? Relax. Let's go have a drink, huh? I know a guy who'll fix that finger right I, up. I can't. I gotta go meet someone. Boy, you're in a hurry, huh? She must be a real ripe tomato. <laughs> you wanna go meet Johnny's tomato, Sal? I like a ripe tomato. That tomato's my wife. Always wanted to meet the wife. Uh, we'll play canasta. Just the four of us. Huh? Okay, but he's not asking, Johnny. He's telling. That's gonna hurt my mom. Uh... Okay. That seems like a good point to stop. Yeah. This game is really cool. Uh, the story's interesting. The characters are engaging. Um, yeah, everything has a really nice look and vibe to it. Uh, controls can be a little bit janky sometimes, but definitely not bad. I'm really enjoying this. Also... Okay, so he doesn't actually count as a shadow. Whoa! Uh, uh... Okay. I can now fly, because I make up superpowers whenever I want them. Okay. Goodbye, everybody.